stop dropping this I ain't never gonna stop till I can show it pop I am unstoppable, so unstoppable There is no limit to how far I can go who let the mud up? Who, 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 who? What up, y'all? Solo right here, coming from you from New York, baby. The big NYC, New York City. Yeah, yeah. Um, just here doing a little commentary. My brothers and I'm gone, and I just decided to do one before they get back because I don't really like talking about talking into the mic with people around or just talking on the phone in general. I prefer texting people, but other than that. I'll leave that for another another video that I can do, but this one I'm just going to give you an update on New York, and sorry if my mic sounds a little weird, I'm using the mic for my Beats headset, and yeah, I know I have my Terry Beaches X1s with me, so hopefully I still sound pretty good, just let me know, and yeah, well, in New York, it's pretty of a good city, I, all I've pretty much done is see the Empire State Building, went to the Statue of Liberty, uh, I went to the house not how my house. <laughs> I always call it the House of Wax, but it's just a celebrity place with the wax, the wax place with all the celebrities. And that's a place that I pretty, I like that place. That place was pretty cool. Got some pics on there, over there. Pick, got a few pics from the Empire State Building too, and the Statue of Liberty. But I got more out of the celebrity wax place. A lot of good celebrities there, and I had to take pictures with them. And I'll probably post those on Facebook. And if you want to add me on Facebook, feel free to. I'll leave that in the link below. And yeah. Other than that, I went to watch X-Men today, and I would highly recommend you go watch that movie ASAP, man, as soon as possible, dude, just go watch it, even though I don't know how much the movies are where you live at, but hopefully it's not as much as here, New York price says everything expensive, but I'll talk about that later, but yeah, X-Men, go watch, it explains pretty much everything that has happened up to the movies how everything I don't want to really spoil everything to you just say the powers in there are amazing everything is just good I would give it like a 9.5 out of a scale of 10 and a 4.9 out of 5 it's just that great to me there's never really a perfect movie out there because there's always something I would really like to change in the movie just a tad a little bit in some parts in there but yeah, you can't really do that because then it won't lead up to the main point. But yeah, it's all good, whatever. But yeah, go watch that movie. And then the other thing I did today was took a three hours cruise about all New York City, Manhattan. Not really all around it, but we went around Manhattan, and that takes you to all the under the bridges and stuff like that for three hours. I took a, a nap <laughs> for like 30 minutes at the beginning because it took forever to take off, and I was just sitting there out in the sun. And the sun was like right on me. I was like, whoa, dude, I gotta go take a nap right fast. And rolled up my sleeves, can't get the, the dang farmer tan. Gotta get my good tan, you know what I mean? And so I just chilled back, relaxed, and I took a big old nap, snooze. And then I woke up well, uh, like th right after we got to the Statue of Liberty, I was like, yeah, yeah perfect timing. Because I already went to such delivery, so waking up then is perfect, and I could just see all the other surroundings after that. And and it was nice. We got to see the Yankee Stadium there, going to Yankees game Wednesday. And I already got in the Mets game. That was fun. And, yeah, now let's talk about Mets, I guess. Well, for the Mets game, we went because my cousin, Carlos Beltran, plays for that team. He's my cousin by marriage, and he is a real sweet dude, man. He's pretty cool. He... Uh, I met him before he became pro back in when I went to Puerto Rico and I was like, I want to say, I don't know how long ago, one Christmas break, I was really young, I wasn't even I think a teenager then, but yeah, it was, he, he was a real cool, uh, laid back dude, just real cool back, if you haven't uh, watched him play, I say go watch him play dude, he's a pretty good baseball player, he is a pro too, but yeah, yeah. We start and the Mets game was tied. We uh had a good five game uh five uh one inning. We got five runs. We didn't watch that game. We saw it. When did we watch it? When did we watch it? When did we watch it? I want to say Saturday. We went. It was eight o'clock game. That game went by fast too. Every inning was like three up, three down, pretty much. And 
It was good. I, I wish I could have gone watch more games though when I was here, because, <laughs> excuse me, but, yeah, just, my dad planned a trip, and that's all we pretty much have done, is what I said, and going to Yankees game. Oh, and we want to take the old, some Broadway shows. That should be interesting. Go watch the Lion King one. That's the one I'm really looking for. I love Disney stuff. I haven't figured out I'm a little kid at heart, but, video's over. Hope you all enjoyed it, and... Just take care, y'all. Peace. I'm breathing with smoke in the backyard lines. We used to laugh until we choked, until we wasted nights. It was the best time of my life, but now I sleep.